Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. How do I add an LDAP to a WebSphere Federated Repository setup? This setup assumes that you have already set up a Federated Repository using the file-based registry. If you have not completed the steps, visit the comments section for a link on how this is done. Log in with your credentials. Expand security. Click global security. Under available realm definitions, make sure to select federated repositories and click configure. Click add repository. LDAP, custom, etc. Click New Repository. Click LDAP Repository. Type in the name to identify the repository. Select the directory type. Type the primary host name of the LDAP. Type the port for the LDAP. For this example, we will keep 389 default. Type the bind distinguished name. Type the bind password. Under Federated Repository Properties for Login, you can add multiple as needed. Each property needs to be separated by a semicolon. For example, UID semicolon mail. Be aware, if you're receiving errors with the parameters you are using, you can use the LDAP test query feature on the related items. Refer to the comments section for a link on how this is done. Click OK. Type the base distinguished name. Click OK. Save the changes. Log out of the system. Important, a restart of WebSphere is required for the new LDAP to start working. You have successfully added an LDAP to your Federated repository. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.